Good day guys. Hope everything is well with everybody. Uh, hope you get more to the water than we do currently. Uh, today I just want to make a small video regarding the deeper sonar. I had a request previously. Sorry for taking so long to showing it. Uh, when I'm on the kayak I get zoned in and I forget about side projects like a tutorial or something. Very nice small device. Uh, still having my little swivel for the connection to the rod. Uh, we were bank fishing and I decided to make a screen recording about the scanning and how it works. So I'm just going to make a quick little video showing how it works. There's some stuff that uh, will be better showing on the kayak. Uh, so this was a bank session and uh, yeah, let's dive into it and see how it works. As I as mentioned, this is the Pro Plus 2 model, the deeper smart sonar, nice little small device in the palm of my hand. Uh, this device connects to your phone uh, via Wi-Fi. So the moment you put it in the water, it switches on, you connect to the Wi-Fi. Uh, when you get the connection, you open the app and it will connect to a GPS and it will show your position wherever you are. Okay, we've connected the deeper to a rod. Uh, first cast was not very far. This is also new to us. Uh, decided also for the, as the river is very deep, you can see 4.7 meters there. On the map, left hand side, you have distance markings and it will show you where the deeper is in relation with that distances. As I'm reeling it in slowly on the right hand side, uh, you can see the traditional uh, fish finder scanning. Too shallow, deep, out of water, that means it lost connection. Those two metal points is the deeper on and off switch. It uh, connects automatically. When it touches water, the device switches on. And when you take it out of the water, it switches off. So with the bank angling, every time you take it out, the device loses, uh, switches off, it loses connectivity. Searching GPS found again, and you can reel it back to get the scanning and see what is going on there. You can see on the distance marking, the throw is about at 30 meters out and slowly retrieving it again for the scanning to see. Uh, settings available while uh, device is working. There is all the settings. Uh, I will go through that one day on the kayak uh, to show everything nicely. As you zoom in on the map, uh, you will get a better picture of the scanning. Um, different colors show different depths. Uh, out of water, you can see, showing you the devices out of the water. Uh, looking for GPS, the cast was made back on the 30 meter mark and we start scanning again. On the top bar, uh, different information. Uh, we'll get there now. Uh, 
the left top we have the current time underneath that we've got the water temperature it's gonna show you now there there's the water temperature in the middle we've got the viewing device top is the cell phone battery power bottom is the deeper battery power and then on the right hand side there is the radius of the scanning that depends on the angle that the beam is working on and then bottom is the first time that I see that that must be when you're using the bank option and as other sonars you also get the depth three meters at this stage you can see that last cast was almost to the 40 meter mark and using the current to keep it on the left side to fill in the blank spots there Something that's also nice about the Deeper is everything is stored on your phone. Uh, you upload it to the Deeper Cloud also. And afterwards, or when you have a break, you can go to your history. You select the scan that you want and you can review it. If that scan is six hours long, you can review six hours uh, where you were, uh, what the bottom was like and see for what you want to see okay guys uh, hopefully you get a better understanding of the uh, deeper after this that is just the basics nice little device portable you can take it wherever you want it's not a fixed transducer you can use it on a boat you can use it on a kayak you can use it on a bait boat and from the bank um, that was just the basics uh, Hopefully you understand it a little bit more. Uh, if there's any questions, ask, I'll try to answer that. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Thanks for all the subscribers. Thanks for sticking with us, even in the time that we don't put out a lot of content. Hopefully it will get better soon. Um, have a good one. God bless. Be safe. Bye-bye.